I don't know guys. I didn't measure the door of New York City. Hmm. Hmm. I hope it fits. I never even thought about that. Uh oh. What's up modern steaders? We're gonna build a nesting box for the ducks today. It's gonna be our last duck effort. We need to build a nesting box for the ducks. I do believe we have one broody duck. That'll be really neat if she ends up hatching out some ducks for us. It'll take 28 days, unfortunately. It takes a week longer than chicks do to hatch out. But we'll have to be patient and time will tell. Let's go grab some rough sawn lumber. Every modern homestead needs a pile of rough sawn lumber. Thanks, Jeff. So let's go see what we can find for building material. This is kind of our coal pile. It's a little bit of a red rot in these boards, but that'll work out perfectly for a nesting box for the ducks. I think this board should be long enough to make it for us. Come on, plow it out. Good girl. I don't know how well you can see it. I can't get too close We got the fence. But I'm still only seeing three ducks. One female by the water, a male but to the right of the apple tree, and there's, the other male is inside the apple tree. So there is that one female duck that's still missing. I'm thinking she's broody. Let's get our workshop set up for this project. The girls started doing a project today and they didn't videotape it. What the heck? They're making this desk or cleaning up this desk for Olivia. Got it all sanded down, ready for paint. We're gonna make it 24 inches long, 16 inches deep. I gotta figure out the height of it. You know what I was just thinking? I should have built this out of mahogany. What the heck? You guys would have loved it if I made it out of mahogany.
We're not going for anything fancy on this. We just want a nice little box that our ducks will lay eggs in. And that we built from... And that we could build from supplies we had around the homestead. I don't know, I'll just have you tighten up the screw. Okay, go for it. Oh, perfect. Alright, you can get that one. You don't need to pull it first? No, I need to pull it for this one. Oh, you lost How it. How does that happen? Did now pull the trigger. It pull no, it? Pull the trigger, yeah. Okay, ready? Yeah. Go. Yep. Perfect. I'll flip it over and do the same thing. I just want to see if I got it. I'll have to pull yeah. a little bit, but not too much. Yeah, well, I should have pushed sap on it. Sap. Why is my I'm having such a trouble? You gotta push, keep down pressure on it. Oh, okay. So instead of having this hand here, have it here. They go, they really go. They do. Okay, go for it. Good. The pot we never like to do, cleaning up. Everything has its place, somewhat at least. It's not an every, it's not a very neat place, but it's got a place. guys I didn't measure the door of New York City hmm hmm I hope it fits I never even thought about that uh oh <laughs> I think it's gonna go oh look at that just barely goes 
Whew, that was pure luck. Boy, I'm lucky that just fit in there. Uh, we'll stick this over here in the corner for the girls. There, I hope the ducks end up liking that. What are you doing? Hello. While we're close to the potato bin, let's go check on them. They're doing pretty good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. They really seem to be liking this warmer weather, which is awesome. I can't wait till they get a little bit taller so we can put another layer of spent hay and leaves on the pile. And I'm looking forward to some nice fresh potatoes this growing season. What are you doing? I don't know. Play what song are you playing? Oh, Joy. Go ahead, play it. Bravo, bravo. We were asked to do a video with Art and Brie, and that went live yesterday. So I'm gonna leave a link in the description below to our video and to their channel. If you guys don't know them, they're a really great daily vlogging channel. They're sharing their homesteading experience with their family. They're working on transforming their property into their modern homestead. They've been really busy this spring with their goats, milk cow, their gardens, they're putting up fence. They have crazy amount of stuff going on on their channel. You think we're busy? Go check them out. And they upload daily. So if you guys haven't seen their channel, I'll put the links in the description below. I ordered the chicken plucker the other day off of Amazon. It said three day prime shipping. Guess what? It only took two days. It's supposed to be here today, so we'll get it set up tonight and we get to use it tomorrow when we harvest our meat birds. We'll see you guys tomorrow. If you guys like the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, share it, it really helps. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you're new. We wanted to say thank you to all the new subscribers and thanks to all of our older subscribers. And we'll see you right back here tomorrow at Lumna Acres, a guide to modern homesteading, self-sufficiency, and freedom.